All right, right now we got to take all the electrics. This is the box for the generator. So this is gonna have to get mounted into the dash. So in order to do that, we're gonna have to take the components out of this box and then reassemble them into the truck. Oh, we're gonna have to relocate all that. And here, you can see how this is kind of wobbled out. Eh? Is that just glued on? I think it's glued on. I think yeah. it's glued on. So it's good, it's easy. And then I'll do the exact same thing from the other side. I just hope it's not riveted in. I think it's, um, yeah. if you're opening this up, just let me open it up for a second. Yeah, so these are all just, yeah, just screws. screws. Well, why they use different ones? I don't know. Who knows? This the this is kind of weird. So that switch there, the emergency. I have no idea how they put it in. They might have riveted it in. Uh, I'm hoping those screws from the front will let it pop off. Uh, no, those are. Uh, I'm thinking it's one big. Looks like one big bolt here. Yeah, same as this too, eh? Yeah. yeah, it's a little snap ring. So I'll have to figure out how to get that knob off. Yeah. Well, or is it easier to disconnect it and leave those couple... Com we, yeah, we can disconnect that wire and leave those wires in with it. And then this one, probably easier to pull these wires off. Hmm. I'd rather just give them the plate without anything in it. Yeah. Let's figure out a way to get that off. I think it's easier than we think. I think if we sw swivel it, it'll come right out. Oh yeah, that's just a ground to ground. Okay. I already started the photo album. Oh, okay. Um, it's, it's this actually. So this is still hardware down there, right? There's a hinge. So let's remove Yeah, but we're gonna well. have to get this somehow rotated and through. So I'm thinking if we tilt it up. There we go. We'll just put the old parts back on so we don't lose anything. And that one here too. It's against the wall. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I almost got it. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay. And then it go through. Perfect. I got to lower that down. We got the plate free. So now we're going to mount this into the dash of the truck and we're just going to store this away in the box for now until we get the dash ready to install. Fragile. Well guys, there we go. We now have the Edison uh, truck back at the shop motors in everything's mounted now hopefully in a couple weeks all the drive motors batteries everything else is going to show up and we can start installing it all but till then we gotta next step is take that uh box that we disassembled put it in the new dash here's how the new dash turned out Find the little spot right there. It does? Okay. Alrighty, we're getting the wiring underway here. It's a big task, as you guys can see. There's tangles and messes of wires everywhere. We had to put a towel over the openings on the generator there just so we don't drop our plethora of tools, bolts, metal shavings down there. Pulled out all of the terminal blocks and mounted them to the firewall. And we're just managing, we being this guy, managing the wires as well as looming them up to protect them, keep them looking good. Anything we don't have to replace, we won't, but we will be extending. Carl, that kills people!